Mr. Anderson is on the house. It's February 23rd. Please rise for a moment of silence and a push to the flag. Attention all 11th graders, tomorrow the class of 2024 will be participating in a financial literacy event hosted by the, the organization called Junior Achievement. You will be participating in games, competitions, and activities that relate to finances and budget building that will start during first period and wrap up around 2.30 p.m. You will be assigned to a team and a teacher to help guide you through the event, which will be shared in period one before the event begins. The Media Center is ho hosting Beach Day on Monday, February 27th during lunch periods. There will be snacks, music, a photo op, and limbo. Come join the fun. For more information or to sign up, stop by the circulation desk in the Media Center. Bake sale! Bake sale! Woo! The Anime Club is holding a bake sale fundraiser. The delicious baked dessert items can be found for purchase outside Mr. Hershey's room at the end of the day. All this week at the rear exit at 3 p.m. Yummy! Now over to Lauren with the news. No, oh, hey! Everyone, it's me, Spencer Shea, with something I know you love. <laughs> no, not that. I could get in trouble for that. I'm gonna do the news! The news. Too bad I'm doing it! Today for FFO, FFA week, we should be rocking that college gear. Now, for Ag Trivia of the Day, did you know that there are 116 land-grant universities in the U.S., including Penn State? The land-grant system began in 1862 with the passage of the Morrell Land Grants Act. This law gave states public lands provided for the lands to be sold or used for profit and the proceeds used to establish one college, hence land-grant colleges, that would teach agriculture and the mechanical arts. Do not forget that this week, tomorrow, Boots and Flannel Day, make sure you dress to show off your FFA spirit. Come out on Saturday, March 4th for the Glow Out Night, Neon Minithon, to raise funds for, di for, for diamonds. We'll be having a variety of games, food, Kana Ice, a mechanical bowl, and a dance party with lots of fun. If you did not get a registration form last week, please see Mrs. Sosi or Mrs. Hopkins. The due date for the registration form is Monday, so please get them in as soon as possible. 
Minithon is also right around the corner, so are you ready to show off your neon colors to support the kids? The best way to do this is participating in Spirit Week. Starting Monday the 27th, we will be kicking off the week with Penn State Day. Followed by Penn State Day, we'll also have Neon Wars, PJ Day, Blackout with Glow Sticks, Rock Your Minithon Shirt Day, and on Wednesday and Thursday during lunches, we'll be selling glow sticks for $1 to rock your blackout outfits. Your second period teacher will give you a ticket if, you're partic if you participate, which will be entered into a raffle. Do not forget, this is all for the kids. Now back to the main desk. Sign up to take the ASVAB today. If you're in 10th, 11th, or 12th grade and need some help making career decisions, then consider taking the ASVAB. The ASVAB is designed to help you learn more about yourself and the world of work. Explore occupational skills in line with your interests and skills, and develop a strategy to realize your career goals. This free assessment is offered at EHS on Wednesday, March 15th, and there's absolutely no military commitment by taking the test. For the juniors who need to complete the Act 158 Keystone Graduation Requirement, this is a great way to fulfill that. All you need to do is score a 31 on this test. You can find the sign-up link in Schoology as well as on the counseling webpage. On this Friday evening, February 24th at 7 p.m., there is a free, yes, free concert open to the public. Musicians from uh, Ecuador, Andes Mata, will be for performing in the high school auditorium. They play uh, traditional folkloric music of the Andes Mountains and will have a dance group with them, too, performing the traditional dances. These, these musicians travel around the country and even make a lot of their own instruments by hand. Bring your family, bring a friend, come and immerse yourself in another culture. Friday, February 24th at 7 p.m. Attention juniors, Thaddeus Stevens College will be hosting a college fair on Tuesday, March 14th. This fair attracts approximately 100 different colleges, universities, and trade school representatives. This is a great opportunity for 11th graders to interact with and learn about different colleges, which was a main focus of the recent junior transition meetings. Space is limited, so if you are interested, please print out a field trip permission packet from Schoology or pick one up from the counseling office and return it ASAP. Now over to lunch. Sand. Castles. Um, anyway, for lunch today, we got French toast sticks, bacon egg, extravaganza, French bread pizza, or French bed as Wes likes to call it. French bed pizza? I said French bed pizza. <laughs> the Italian hoagie, the crispy popcorn chicken salad, but who could forget the fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin? I pioneered the one-handed backhand. And eventually, the no-handed backhand. The EASD Mountain Bike Club is rolling out on the trails this spring. Join us. The club is open to all students in grades 6 to 12 and caters to all riders with any abilities and specializing in the development of new and beginner riders. We meet weekly on Wednesdays from April 5th through May 24th and have a group ride scheduled on weekdays at Camp Mount, Mac, and Mount Bretna, Hershey, and Blue Marsh. For more information, please contact the club advisor, Brent Kometz. Now back to the main desk. <laughs> for the Science Department hosted the Science Fair the weekend of February 10th and 11th. Now that all judging is complete and we have tallied all the votes, the final rankings are in. The following students play satisfactory. Brandon Thomas, Ethan Brinzer, Mason Dame, uh, Charles Lydamore, Mary Martin, Maxwell Reef, uh, Jack Sarver, and Caleb Zimmerman. The following place commendable. Alex Bellagrove, uh, uh, Janessa Eshelman, Evan Folker, Peyton Woos, Nova M, Chloe Moa, Scarlet Moa, um, Elena Rajitz, Logan Reichenbach, James Robbins, Zachary Sensenink, Preston Shaneyfelt, Andrew Thomas, Ariel Young, Nathan Bueller, Kari Parsons, Ethan Lloyd, and Dakota Fry. The following place excellent. Rebecca Abraham, Evelyn Banks, Caden Bayer, Sarah Brass, Camille Cochin, Anna Camaro, uh, Garden Flores Lindsay, Gavin Hopp, uh, Jacob Jankowski, 
Catherine Kochev, Co sorry. Anna Morgan, Nicole Morel, Nolani Potterheads, um, Brandon Pauser, Peyton Rideout, Courtney Smith, Silas Smith, Quinn Watson, Reese Swanger, Lance Wilson, Hannah Yaw, uh, Jeremiah Knowles, Anastasia Lehman, Joanne Earhart. And the following were superior. Lydia Est, Mackenzie Flora, Kaylee Horst, Lydia Lehman, Hayden Leonard, Gianna Wong, Kayla Reidenball, Nicholas Ryan, Ashmeen Sinar, Talia Todd, Emily Widener, Kaylee Walters, and Alexis Kresge. Congratulations to, to everybody who participated. Students will go to Homeroom for ACT today. Have, Have a great, great day, day Africa. Africa.